This is the Daily Pulse from Speak My Word Ministries of Travis Zimmerman. Second today, you know, a wrapping up session on the passport issue as I shared yesterday. We realized almost a little too late that we needed a passport to get not, not just out of the United States, but get back in the United States when we visit Niagara Falls. And we were all, we were, <laughs> we basically met as a family. We were terrified. You know, I wouldn't say terrified, but just sick, I guess, you know, downtrodden. Like, gosh, we just, you know, we, we've been looking forward to this vacation for a long time. And we've been talking about it. It's been 19 years since Susan and I honeymooned there. And we we're telling the kids all about it, how beautiful the falls are. And the falls, you know, it's such power that it's just a reflection of God. I mean, it, you stand there, it's almost like a, you know, from what I've heard, like a Grand Canyon experience or, or, or looking at the, the, uh, you know, the keys and just the beautiful landscape, recognizing this can only be God. So we met as a family yesterday and we, and we joined hands and we prayed. We said, God, please, please, if it be your will, just open up a door for us here and help us accept if this is, if this is your will for us. If this, and that we're not to go and we're not going to be able to, to enjoy this family vacation, we accept that. We would pray, Father, that you would intercede. And he did. And he interceded through my bride. She made some calls and you know the data we got initially was partially right but partially wrong. And Suzanne and I found out there was actually an easier way to get this done in even a short amount of time. And it involved visiting Philadelphia. So so the passport here. You know, I, I've got to go to First Thess Thessalonians chapter five, verses sixteen, eighteen. Be joyful always. Pray continually and give thanks in all situations, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus, right? Be joyful always. Pray continually. So when be joyful because you know, not because you know you lost your job, jo joyful about that, but joyful, have an overall joy that Jesus is in charge of this. He's in charge of everything. And that we're pray continually. Pray when it's good, pray when it's bad. Pray all the time and give thanks. It's, you know, and give thanks in all situations, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Lord, thanks for the insights. Thanks for the Holy Spirit prompting us to do that. Thanks for opening this door, most of all. Thank you for Jesus' in name. In your name, Father. Amen.